Hello, welcome. My name is Carol, and this is your 15-minute guided meditation. We'll begin in a seated position. You either sit with support on the floor, I'm sitting on a little yoga block, or you can sit in a chair. So as we just begin to settle into our space, let's just start with a silent few breaths just to make that transition from our everyday life into our meditation practice. Today's theme is nurturing the season of your soul. So just like in nature, we have shifts and changes within us. So fall has just begun as I'm recording this, and I could tell the changing of the leaves have already started, along with a little cooler temperature, which is great because I love sweater weather. <laughs> And it's time to create some quiet moments for yourself to rest and reset. So let's get started with some gentle movements to really wake up the spine and the upper body. So we have a little bit more ease to the breath and we can sit with a proper posture. So take your arms and reach them overhead. Now take them as far as they'll go up. They might not be really close to your ears, just see if you can get a lot of length. And then exhale, draw the hands down to heart center. Let's do that two more times. Just elevate the shoulders, lift them up. And exhale, come back to center. Taking your hands down to your lap and start with some cat cow. So drawing the belly back towards the spine and then pulling the sternum forward, slight gaze up if it feels comfortable on your neck. And just continue here, rounding back for cat and pulling forward for cow. You could always do these movements with your eyes closed or open. That's a couple more. These feel really good if you've been working at a desk all day. And then drop ear to shoulder. So just pick a side and just let it hang. And if you want to just trace your fingers up and down the side of your neck that's getting the release. Just a gentle massage, even massaging behind the ear. Come slowly back up to center. And let's do the other side. Ear to shoulder, gentle massage. And then come back up. At any time, if you want to adjust your seat, um, shake out your legs a little bit and then come back. Let's start with a little flow. So our pattern will be taking out the arms to the side and then dropping just one palm. If you're sitting on a chair, just drop it down to the chair seat and then reach over. So I'm opening up the side lateral body, coming back to arms out to the side and then taking this little side bend to the opposite side back up and then lower the arms down. So let's try this pattern again, reaching side to side, little lateral stretch, really feeling length in the side rib cage. And then lower down. Now two more times. I'll do it with you, but I'll stay silent. And 
release. Now let's just take a gaze to the left, not trying to force it and gaze to the right. So I'm not twisting my torso yet, <laughs> not yet. I'm just getting the head moving. Shoulders are remaining over the hips. And as your head turns, have your eyes continue. So your eyes are looking out your peripheral vision as well. And just complete the one that you're on. And return to center. So very similar to that side flow, let's take a little twist. And we're not forcing the twist, we're moving and then we're gonna hold later. So come into cactus arms or goal post arms if you're a football fan. And then turn around the low rib cage area. So my hips are firmly into the ground, my pelvis is staying rooted down. Coming back to center, twist around that low rib cage area. Center and then release. Taking it again, cactus arms. And it doesn't matter which way your wrists are going. Coming back to center, release. Two more times on your own. And release it down. Now we're going to hold the twist. So inhale and think of lengthening the spine. And then exhale, take a twist. So my hands are just there to support myself. Release back to center. Inhale and then exhale, twist. and then returning back to center again. Let's just take some shoulder rolls. So go forward and hit all four corners of that shoulder roll. So depressing down, protracting back, elevating, um, protracting forward, I mean. So retracting when your shoulder blades pull together and then taking it the opposite direction, shoulder rolls back. So depressing down, forward, protracting, elevating and retracting. And then last but certainly not least, <laughs> low rib cage circles. So even if you want your hands there around the low rib cage, I'm gonna press it out to the side, forward, out to the side, and then back. So I'm just circling around, try to smooth it out around the low rib cage. So it's a little combination of uh, cat cow that we did and then that side lateral stretch. And then reverse it. Often the reverse is a little harder. <laughs> Let's go slow. Get the pattern first. Sometimes I really got to think about it. <laughs> and then smooth it out. And then release. Shake out the hands. Shake out the legs again. And then find your seated position that's going to work for you, knowing that you could always take this lying down if you get uncomfortable. So as you settle, I want you to find sitting slightly forward of your sit bones. So I'm kind of moving around to feel the sit bones and then dropping the front of the pelvis. So I'm sitting just slightly forward of the sit bones. So the pelvis is the root of the spine. And then grow your spine tall, just like the trunk of a tree, releasing any effort from your shoulder, your shoulders, your throat, your face. And invite a small bow down of your chin. You can either have your hands resting on your lap, or sometimes I like to interlace my fingers and just have this kind of O shape to the arms. Soften or close your eyes. Draw your attention to the center of your brain. Just imagine 
tracing your head in your mind's eye, left to right, front to back, and up and down. Relax the root of your tongue. Settle in, back, and down. Witnessing the sensations of the breath. Seeing each breath cycle as unique. Noticing the moment when each inhale begins and each exhale completes. Allowing the breath to flow through you without control, without effort. Welcoming ease to your body, your breath, and your mind. And release into your silent three-minute meditation now. Slowly begin to deepen the breath. You could adjust the way your legs are, just shake them out. And take any movements that feel good. And I'll leave you with a little poem from Journey to the Heart. There is a purpose and value in each day of your life, in each season of your life. Nurture your times of action, of creating, of doing, and value your quieter times of going within. The more you study nature, the more you will learn about yourself, 
nurture and trust the seasons of your soul. So taking that theme with you for the rest of the day and the rest of the week, the light, the love, the teacher in me sees and honors the light, the love, the teacher in you. Namaste. Thank you very much for joining me. Take care.